Hi ladies, hi gents. Um, just want to share a project and a haul with you today and um, a couple of flowers that I made. I've been really busy this week preparing for a wedding and actually going to the wedding. Um, but I decided to make a couple of flowers, one for my handbag for the wedding and one for my lapel. So I just want to share those with you. Okay, so this was my handbag for the wedding and I just made this this rosette flower to go on the handbag and I just put it onto a, a brooch back. I also made one a little bit fuller um, for the lapel of my jacket and all I've done is added it onto one of these brooch backs. So I was really pleased with how these turned out and it just looked fantastic on my outfit. And so original. Um, so, you know, if you're going to a, a wedding or a christening or something like that, you know, you can make your own accessories to go with your outfit. And it was so nice to, you know, have the match on, on, on my handbag. Anyway, I just wanted to share those with you. <laughs> and it was a lovely wedding. Um, a lot of work and I'm very tired. <laughs> anyway. Okay, so last week I ordered um, some wooden items from eBay. And I just want to share the first thing, item with you because that's actually what I've used to make my project. Okay, I found these gorgeous MDF bird cages. And they are so beautiful. Um, so it's the bird cage with two lovebirds sitting on a perch. And I just love um, all this this cut at the bottom. Pick that up so you can see. And um, I am going to pop the seller in the description bar. Um, he sold other items. I will show them to you after I've shared my project with you. Um, so you can see what else they sell. Okay. So I started off with one of these uh, canvas boards which is 10 inches by 12 inches and this is my um, finished project. Uh, so I painted the canvas board and then I just distressed it around the edges lightly in pink. I painted the birdhouse white and also distressed round the edges in pink on that. And I've got a glue string. <laughs> okay. I'm just going to show you the edges. See, I used, um, which one did I use? I used the Victorian velvet. Here. and also on the birdhouse, on the edges. Okay, so I then took the, the pink burlap, burlap that I found and I glued that onto the canvas as a background. Here, and I just frayed the edges to give it a bit of texture. I added some lace at the bottom and then some flat back pearls on top of that and the lace is just this tiny tiny one here and I also I embossed the birds 
here. I rub the distress ink all over the, the birds to give them a bit of colour and then I just use clear embossing powder over that to give them a nice gloss. I'm not sure if you can see it actually. Maybe slightly. And then I just added lots of flowers. <laughs> so I had these sort of floral sprays. Well, I had one, it was very long. And uh, I just cut it into sections. And then, so I added one along here, but then what I did is I took paper flowers in pinks, the pink roses, rosebuds, and I twisted it into this floral spray just to add a bit more to it and a bit of colour to tie in the pink. I also then added some lace at the top of the birdhouse or birdcage and I did the same again. I added lots of pink flowers and twisted it into the spray. So these are smaller roses and a larger one. I didn't use rosebuds on this one. And I also did the same glue strings. <laughs> Just hate the glue strings. Oh. Okay. So I also did the same at the top here and I just added a couple of rose buds and a rose to the centre of it. So I really like how that turned out. I think it looks quite cute. Um, I just took some pearl letters and I used my Copic Market marker to change the colour of them. And I just called it Love because obviously it's Love Birds. So I thought that would be quite cute. And this is obviously all inspired by going to the wedding. <laughs> and then up here in the corners, I took a couple of these metal corners and I actually painted them with acrylic paint, painted them white give them that shabby feel <laughs> and then if I just turn it around and then I just used some white wire spirals and some little um, glittery spray some ribbon roses some baby's breath and another rose if I just show you so I used the the white ribbon roses, the white baby's breath. I think I actually got these at Wild Orchid Crafts as well. I think they do them in lots of different colours. But um, they just look cute with the, the little pearl sprays coming out the centre. Uh, I used one of these sort of leaf sprays, sort of twiggy sprays and I think I picked these up at the NEC when I went to the NEC I think and the same with these these little white spiral wires which are easy enough to make with your wires um, but I already had these so I just used these so that's what I used in both the corners um, I'm quite happy how that turned out. I think it looks really cute with the lovebird theme. Um, I also added a couple of these um, applique butterflies. There's one in each corner. Here and here. I absolutely love these. I think they are so cute. Um, so that's my quick project. Um, I'm just going to move that to one side. And I'm just going to go back to the, the birdhouse. Okay, so I, I found these and I know they give you the sizes, but you know, until you actually get them, you can't quite imagine what they're going to be like. 
and when these arrived I was absolutely over the moon with it absolutely fantastic okay so I'm going to sh show you a few other things that they sell so they sell these butterflies you know they're, they're a good size they're about three and a half inches at the widest parts and you can either buy them in three three of them or ten of them and they're actually very good price I can't remember all the prices offhand but you know I'll pop the link down below they also sell keys which are gorgeous I absolutely love these there's just so much you can do with these bare wood um, embellishments. Just sit those there so you can see them. Um, they sell these cute little um, huts with a heart. Okay. Uh, great for putting on a project. They also sell them like this with a heart cut out. So they're cute. So, well, they, I know they sell tags because I've gone back and ordered some wooden tags. But they also sell these plaques with the holes cut, two at the top to hang stuff, and then four at the bottom to hang the hearts from. And I think they do uh, a two run, two holes at the bottom of one, and a three run. So three holes at the bottom of one. They also sell the plaques on their own. They also sell the hearts on their own. Um, but fantastic service. Um, and I'm so happy with them. They are absolutely great. They also sell tiny embellishments. Which are these tiny butterflies and they are so cute really cute so pop along there and check them out because um, I think they're amazing <laughs> you know, it's the first time I found stuff like this online at the prices they're offering uh, so definitely worth a look and um, well, I hope you like and I will speak to you all soon. Bye for now.